Hello, it's Markham Matosh here from Markham 3D, and today we're going to have a very quick overview over the Scatter add-on. Every Monday night, I do Blender add-on reviews. If you would like me to review an add-on, paid or free, please let me know. Leave a comment, and also while you're at it, hit that like button, and hit the subscribe button if you haven't. I've already installed the Scatter add-on, as we do normally. Let's start off and delete that default cube. Shift A mesh out of plane. From here, I'm just going to scale it up a smidgen. I'm going to press N to bring up our side panel, and I've got the Scatter add-on all the way down the bottom here. From here, the target, I'm going to select this target. Now we've got to select a biome manager. As soon as we click that, it opens up the preferences. And from here, we've got a whole bunch of biomes that we can choose from. So we've got winter biomes down here. Um, we've got the material. So let's add in the Blender 1 material. And that'll be for our plane. And I'm going to select maybe this leaf one up here. So let's select these leaves. And then we can close that. Now, if we look down here, we can see that we've got leaves and we've got certain types of grasses. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna select these grasses down the bottom here and we'll choose a preset. So I'm gonna come up here and we've got various types of presets. We can do some abstract stuff. Um, however, I'm gonna use the blue ones down the bottom, just a simple S and let's click on that. From here, I'm gonna click scatter and there we go. Our grasses have appeared on here. Now I wanna throw some leaves on, so I'm gonna select the leaves. However, I want more leaves. So I'm gonna go simple M and let's scatter them. And there we go. So now we've got this cool effect. And from here, I'm gonna come up into the render settings, go from EV to cycles, just to get some really nice results. And I'm just gonna hit F12. And straight away, we've got some fabulous results. Now let's go back and do a few settings to tweak this. Let's just expand this over a little bit. I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna grab our grass clumps, just the grass clumps. Let's come down into painting, new paint layer. Uh, let's create some painting. I'm just gonna make the radius a little bit bigger and let's draw two lines like so. Cool bananas. Let's go back into object mode. From here, um, let's get rid of, I'm just gonna keep one lot of leaves and we'll come back down here into paint. So this is where we've already painted our layer. So let's now click add influence to selected system. And there we go. Now we've got our tire tracks that go through there. So if I just go into rendered view, let's just click off that. And we can see that we still got that leaf system there, but we've got clear defining areas of where I painted. Beautiful. So it's a gorgeous add on. There's plenty of biomes we can use. Um, we've got where we can add some flowers. Well, if we just click on the materials, uh, sorry, the assets, and let's come under here. Let's find some pretty little white flowers. For some reason that went into Irish. I've got our selected. I want to go, let's go simple S like so. And I'm going to scatter. And now we should have some little white flowers just protruding out a little bit. So let's go into rendered view. And now you can see that this whole area is now added with little flowers. So this is available for download in the description below. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what other add-ons you'd like me to review.